Hello and welcome to Poole Hospital Radiotherapy Department. This is an information video for patients who are about to undergo radiotherapy to the prostate. We hope it will help familiarise you with the department and help answer some of the questions that you might have before you attend. Before you can start your course of radiotherapy, you will need to have a CT planning scan. This will be used to calculate your individual radiotherapy treatment plan. The CT scan we use to plan your treatment must be done with your bladder full and your rectum empty. To achieve this, there are several steps to follow before you attend your planning appointment and during the appointment itself. You will need to prepare for five days before your planning scan. If you do not, you will not be able to have the scan and will need to change your appointment. You will receive a letter and perhaps a phone call with your CT planning scan appointment time. For each of the five days before your planning appointment, you'll be asked to drink two litres, about four pints, of water. Do not include alcoholic, fizzy or caffeinated drinks in these totals. To help with this, we will send you a drinking guide to fill in. It's very important that you drink the fluids as requested as you need to be well hydrated for the planning scan. The letter will also advise you to try to avoid foods which you know make your bowels gassy. Please contact the radiotherapy department if you do not have five days before your planning appointment. We will need to change your appointment to ensure you have enough preparation time. The reason you need to have a full bladder and an empty rectum for the scan is because the prostate is located just below the bladder and in front of the rectum. When your bladder is full, it will push your bowel and rectum out of the treatment area. The rectum needs to be empty so that it receives as little a radiation dose as possible. The size and position of your bladder and rectum will affect the position of your prostate. It's important to follow the preparation steps before each of your radiotherapy treatments as well. This will ensure that your bladder, your rectum and your prostate are always the same size and in the same position. This will increase the accuracy of your radiotherapy treatment and will reduce the risk of short and long-term side effects. We want to make sure that your rectum is empty. To remove any gas or feces, poo in your rectum, we will ask you to use a microenema. A microenema is a method of helping your rectum to empty causing a small bowel movement or passing of wind. We'll explain exactly how to use this, which usually takes about 15 to 30 minutes to take effect. Once the enema has taken effect and your rectum is empty, we'll ask you to empty your bladder. Then we will ask you to drink 600 milliliters of water all at once. After drinking the water, we do not want you to empty your bladder until after the CT scan has been completed. That way, your bladder will be full for the CT scan. Preparation Summary Use the microenema 60 minutes before your CT planning scan. Empty your bladder and rectum of urine, poo and gas 35 minutes before your CT planning scan. Drink 600 milliliters of water 30 minutes before your CT planning scan. Proceed to your CT planning scan. 30 minutes after drinking the water, we will take you into the CT scanning room. We will ask you to change into a gown and lie on the scanner couch. The position you are in when we do the scan will be replicated for each of your treatments. We will make sure that you are comfortable and able to keep still. We will use an ultrasound scanner to check that your bladder is sufficiently full. Then we will move you into the CT scanner. You do not need to hold your breath and you will not feel anything while the scan is being done. If we see that your rectum is too large or your bladder is not sufficiently filled when we do the scan, we will have to make an appointment to repeat the scan in a week's time. This may delay the start of your course of radiotherapy treatment. After the CT scan is finished, you'll be free to go home. 
you'll be given your anticipated treatment start date and some information about the radiotherapy treatment, such as skin care, short and long-term side effects, support and contact information. The planning scan will be sent to your consultant.